All right, what's up, you guys? It's a Shader Gamer back with another video, back with another banger. Look, you guys, hit the subscribe button and join the Shade Team today. If you have not joined the Shade Team yet, then what are you doing? And as you guys can see, it looked like Turtle teleported us to the universe of the Iron Giant. It's not too bad here. Maybe the Iron Giant could actually help us out, you know? Who really gonna stop a giant? But anyway, you guys, let's get right into the video. Look, you guys, this is the thing, right? Tony had put this tweet out, and we talked about this on the channel already, that Iron Giant or any other characters released after the start of the open beta will not be allowed in EVO 2022 Multiverses Tournament. Now, of course, the reason for that, if you ask me and others, is that we think that the reason why Iron Giant would not be allowed because he's still going to have to work on the character, he may be broken. And the last thing you want is for a broken character to be at evil and then somebody win the tournament using a broken character with broken mechanics. Now, this is what I was thinking about too, and I wanted to bring this up because I was really thinking about this question. Like, how broken is the Iron Giant going to be? Like, think about it, right? If you've seen the cinematic trailer, Iron Giant is two times taller than the tallest character in the game, and that is Superman. He's two times taller than him, and it's confirmed that he's going to be about that tall in the game. Now, with a character that tall, you have to think about it. How you going to jump over this character? In matter of fact, if you jump up in the air, if he jump himself and he uppercut you, will it be a lot more easier for him to knock you into the air and KO you unlike some other characters? And then on top of that, this man is a tank, so he going to be able to probably take a lot of damage and he going to have to because you got to think about it. He is going to have a large hitbox. Now, to make up for a large hitbox, you got to have tanky defense because if anybody can hit you with ease, you got to be able to go ahead and take a lot of damage because you have a large hitbox. Now, with a large hitbox, like I said, you're going to be able to take a lot of damage. Then, on top of that, of course, you got to go ahead and deal damage as well. I'm thinking that maybe his attacks might be kind of slow because I'm sure he's going to be able to deal out a lot of damage. Then, on top of that, I heard people say that, hey, he probably going to be a character that go grab a lot. He's going to be a grappler. Now, that's a whole nother ball game because you got to think about it. He's going to have the longest arms in the game. Even Jake the dog himself going to be like, dang, even I can't stretch out that far. <laughs> nah, I'm just kidding. But imagine him being a grappler. He probably going to have a lot of strength to throw you kind of far. Now, this is the thing. He might not be broken. He might not. He probably going to be well balanced. But this is the thing. Imagine if he is broken because, once again, he's going to be a new character. A lot of people probably going to use him and figure out, hey, how can I get easy wins using the Iron Giant? I'm sure people going to find ways to use and abuse his size to go ahead and get an advantage on the opponent. But hey, like I said, he might not even be broken because the question is presented to y'all. How broken will he be? Some of y'all might think he won't be broken at all, which I won't be surprised if he not broken at all either because the development team for player first games, the developers of multiverses, hey, I got to say they first class. I'm sure they're going to have this figured out. I'm sure they're doing a lot of testing when it comes to the Iron Giant. I won't be surprised if he perfectly balanced. But if he do come out to be broken, I won't be surprised either because it's a brand new character. And y'all, this character is literally a giant. He is literally a giant. I am so hyped to see how he played in the game and just to see how everybody is going to use him. And I can't wait to fight him. Like, think about this. You and your teammate got to be like, yo, how are we going to chop him down? We got to find a way to stop this dude because he is a tall character. But I can't wait to go ahead and play against him and use the Iron Giant. I ain't gonna lie, the Iron Giant was a good choice for this game, in my opinion. I think they're really doing a good job putting this roster together. But look, thank you guys for watching. I want y'all to comment down below and let your boy know how broken you think the Iron Giant gonna be. But thank you guys for watching. Make sure you like, comment, share the video, and also subscribe and join the Shade Team. Join the Shade Team. Thank you guys for watching. Shout out to the Shade Team as always, and I'm out.